Oh no, this is the worst time for this because everything is bad. Everything is absolutely terrible right now. This is it, child. We're about to perish. At least I'll get you one last meal before that happens, huh? That fence over there, in the red. It's over. Oh, the zombies are in! Yo, right, everybody, we are here today checking out a little banger. This right here is They Don't Sleep. And this one I'm excited for, because this came out uh, mid-September. It snuck by me. I usually keep a very good vigilant eye on upcoming zombie games, especially zombie survival indie games. And this one just, woof, snuck on by me. Luckily, I was doing a little bit of research recently, and it was suggested to me by Steam. And I was like, really? Okay, what is this? And I looked into it, and I loved everything that I saw and everything that I read. What I saw was a very minimalistic pixel zombie survival game. But what I read is what really intrigued me in that we're essentially a mother with an infant child in a zombie apocalypse. I'm pretty sure you know what that means, right? Infants are relatively loud little creatures. If you've seen A Quiet Place 1 or 2, I think you understand the significance behind this child. It will make noise. It will trigger the zombies. Ooh, that's bad. Can we stop for a second? What now? I'm worn out. I, I wish we at least had a stroller. Quit your nagging. I'll get the truck fixed then when I'm damn well ready. I didn't see anything about the truck. You're always complaining. First you whine about getting tools to fix the truck back in town, then carry the baby. Now this stroller shit. I swear, if you say one more word about... Who is that? <sighs> it's not a good dude. I'll tell you that much. What the hell? Scott, is that you? I don't think that's Scott anymore, dude. Something's wrong with him, Rob. I can see that. Shut up and hold the rifle while I check on him. <laughs> Why is this guy so, like, you know, confrontational? Maybe you shouldn't... I think we understand now how she winds up alone with the baby. Scott? Hey, Scotty, it's me, buddy. What the hell? Oh, get off of me! Oh my god, oh my god. Is that a significant other, or this Scott or Rob guy? Rob? Rob, are you? Uh oh. Rob. Shoot him. Oh, she missed! She's dead. Well, there it is, guys. This is the end of the game. No, it's not the end of the game. You see, as I've mentioned, because it is a roguelite, you will indeed perish, but you will get better. You will improve over time. You will actually keep, be able to keep the skills that you acquire over different runs to eventually make the full escape. What just happened? Everything went white, and then... This is impossible. I shot you. Then... Then I miss when Rob... Is this a second chance? I can't miss this time. You know, when you say, when you aim at the king, you best not miss, right? Just die. Well, I'm not sure what Rob was to us, but uh, he, he is dead to us now, is what I can tell you. I, I shot him, I killed him. No, he was already... What was he? Oh god, what am I gonna do? Baby, it's not the time for this. One step at a time. I've got you, sweetie. Mommy's here. Let's get out of this cold. This is gonna be our fortress, which we have to fortify, keep safe. We have to go out to search for items, leave our baby here. It's the third day since Rob died. I've killed seven more of those... God, they're zombies, aren't they? I can't believe I just wrote that. I need to go to town and get those tools to fix the truck so we can escape. I have to get supplies while I'm there. I'm terrified. So our main goal is to fix this truck and get the hell out of Dodge, right? But obviously, you can't just do it immediately. It's something you have to slowly progress towards. Right now, though, everything seems fine. I need to get the hell out of here and get some supplies for us before zombies start showing up. So, let's hit the road, Jack. But we are gonna come back, so don't say never come back, because we have a child here. It'd be kind of ir irresponsible of us to leave our child here in the zombie apocalypse with themselves. For... ever. View of Stratsville. A repair shop with a gas pump, a dollar store, and a post office, the height of civilization. What should I bring back? Well, right now, our thing is to bring back a toolkit in town. Um, the problem with that is that it weighs 30, which is everything we could carry at the moment. So maybe we just get that out of the way and then we start focusing on maybe supplies? Bad idea. 
Now obviously as this is going, all of our needs are dropping. Supply run is done, we leveled up because we got a significant thing completed here. So if I can make it to Chelsea, maybe we'll be all right. I have to try Chelsea's fishing boat. And choose once that, max 12. So I guess 12 is the limit on each one of them. And we have different things to level up here. As I mentioned, when you do perish, you'll be able to roll these over. Unless you want to play in a hardcore super mode, which if whenever you die, everything resets. I mean, good luck. I hear this is a really difficult game. Uh, fitness lets me walk faster, carry more supplies, and lose less rest. I'm gonna go with that one. Fitness, sure. Now, could I dip back out immediately, or...? Oh no, we gotta deposit the items first, right? Yeah, so the places have returned. Now I could go and dip out if I need to, but... Uh, let's get a little bit of cooking. Oh, zombie! Okay, that fool's gonna have to wait for a second. Yo, 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 excuse me, my friend. Oh no, don't miss! Take the shot! Oh, 94 damage already. It was a 90-something percent shot. That was basically, you know, XCOM right there in a nutshell. Let's get some food here. Uh, one of your needs is slow. Yeah, yeah, I know. This is the type of game, too, by the way, that... Oh, God. Zombie chill, I'm in the pooper. Oh, where's he at? It's over there. Thank you. Oh, wait, can I come in through here? Oh, perfect. And I know there's an exit right there. Okay, so baby, let's do a little bit of baby comfort. Zombie, stay back. And that took care of that. Perfect. Baby. I, I'll be out of the fence. Good shot. Okay, how we looking? I need to get a little bit of rest. Get a little bit of rest. Stress relief. Yeah, that's what I need right now. I need some serious stress relief. And let me get this other meal here. Uh, I can't, I can't. Okay, hold on. Return to soup. Return to slab. I heard you, zombie. Oh, come on. You can't be missing those dice cop shots. I think they left some loot for me up there, too. Okay. Um, so what do we need right now? Uh, let's do cooking. Because I feel like, you know, this woman. Baby! No, baby! Oh, I need something to diaper change. I saw it. And I'm also starving. I need to get that food in me. Yo, yo, yo. Need to get some food. I have high metabolism, apparently. Food just goes zooming out of me. Quiet night, no new zombies, thank you. I got you, I got you, okay. Okay, this is where we can actually get some rest and use the toilet and stress relief. Okay, look. I'm so stressed that I'm over here pooping myself. Hold up, what's stress relief? Stress relief is a sofa and... Oh, a nice little bat, huh? That might be for the best, I would say. Let me get one more rest, though. Let me draw a little bat here. I need to dip out, too, really soon, by the way. Get some more supplies. Okay, that's fine. Uh, just have a snack right now. Oh, baby, come on. You can't be crapping yourself this constantly. He's also hungry. I need to dip outside, dog. You don't understand? Two zombies. Okay, chill, baby. Chill. Chill, 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 chill. Large wave incoming! I wasn't even to even go outside! I'm not even sure I have enough ammunition for all this. There's a bag out there. I need to get out there really soon. Uh, what do you think we need? I mean, what, what do you think we're hurting on? She, she eats <laughs> so often. Cook faster. How about, um... Stress management? Get less stress from zombies and parenting. Oh... Fine, let's get stress management. I need to get that bag out there. All zombies are showing up like crazy. Okay, that's right. The fences are still high, so it's okay. Take supplies, diaper supply. I guess that's fine, since considering the child's over here just pooping itself constantly. Do you think I can lure them to me? Oh. Wait a second. We might have spotted a little bit of a meta here, although she's getting stressed out. This is not the time for you to be hungry, lady. Not the time for this. Yeah, it might just basically increase my stress really quickly by doing that. Oh, no. As long as we can get through this, it's fine. Put him into baby, no! No, baby, this is not the right time for this, because Mama's about to die. You understand? In the spot. I need this meal. Ugh. Cooking, fine. Do it again. Hurry up. Hurry, hurry! 
That's right, don't worry about the fence. Did I not pick up the food? No, I didn't. I perished. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Well, I guess, uh, as I've mentioned, this is the reason why they let you, I think, roll over your stats, because you saw how hectic that was, right? Like, that was just non-stop. I failed. Days played, new best. Six days. Zombies killed 27. I mean, the, the, the hordes wouldn't stop, like, ever. Like, you know, how about, like, a single night of freedom? Never. Now, your, your objectives do reset. You give your stats of your objectives to reset, so obviously that'd be a little bit too easy. If you could just chip away at the objectives, right? So you still gotta, like, you know, page together the perfect run. Um... Get a toolkit again, you say? <laughs> well, we could carry more this time if it means anything, so I actually can do the toolkit. And, uh, how much of the patch kits? Oh, that's... That's really heavy. Ten. Um... Let me get some food. As long as we level up one more time, I think we'll be able to get to cooking four. And I believe that was the, um, upside to getting four meals cooked, if I'm correct. Please, XCOM. I, I don't need it right now. I don't need it. Okay. Now. Over here. Get this cooking. Baby food and comfort. Baby's fine for now. There it is. Cooking complete. So I believe it said... Every four ranks, you cook faster, better meals, more bowls per pot. So now, at least food won't be too big of a concern. I hear that zombie, but don't worry. Got this in me. Now we dip out. And we're not gonna miss, thank you. It drops supplies for us. I'm gonna use this toilet. And guess what? Oh, and baby, I was about to say, guess what? I'm leaving now. Baby comfort. How about, how about improving as a parent falcon? <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna improve by by killing a zombie and leaving right now, okay? That's my improvement. Thank you. I mean, she's a good shot whenever she does land. I mean, these constant headshots. You gotta give it up to her for that, right? Nobody show up, please. Baby, don't, don't start crying. All right. Okay. Now we have a little bit more freedom. Yes, we have to still collect other parts, right? Get parts in town. So spark plug's gonna be, what, 20? Battery is gonna be 20. So we need up to 40 to bring both of those in one go. So we could bring one part right now and a couple of extras, you're saying, right? Sure, we could do that. So bring the spark plugs first, and then... What do you think uh, we would need here? I mean, so far... Let's maybe take like a bit of like one more food. Snacks so that we don't have to stop to cook constantly could be useful as well. Uh, baby formula, I guess we'll pick up one of those. And diapers, we're at 10 right now, I think we're fine there. I wanted to get the fence patch kit, but that's going to be way too much. What about ammo? We could do a little bit of ammo. And I guess we'll bring snacks. Snacks are only one each. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Because again, it lets me, like, you know, get the hell some food in me and then keep moving. Ooh. Nice! More snacks. That's a bag over there for us, too, but that's going to have to wait. Need some rest with her? Don't worry. This is already a much better on the first one. I almost wonder if, like, they, they want you to fail the first time, so you understand the mechanic. Because right now it feels like a bit less stressful than the first time around. Which is constant, like, nothing but waves. I do hear zombies, but that's fine, it's gonna have to wait. Very good, very good. You can bang on that fence, that's fine. Okay, okay, so what do we need right now? Fewer tantrums? Sure. The tantrums have indeed held me back at times, so there is that. Another zombie already, huh? Okay. Use this. Baby, don't start crying right now. Thank you. Now, let's take care of this child, and we dip back out. Two zombies. I could go out right now, and I will. Oh, no! Are you sure about that? And let's go out really quickly. Oh, no, zombie. Okay, baby, don't cry right now because I won't be here. There's a zombie about to start banging the fence. Ooh, what is this? Rare find. Supply runs are faster until the end of this loop. How much is that? Two? Yeah, take it. So, as a roguelite, you also do get some dynamic items in terms of, like, you know, that's going to be only effective for that particular run itself. Interesting. All right. So, yeah, we'll take that. Uh, do we take a battery? I mean, we should try to win, correct? I mean, I, I doubt it's gonna happen this run, but we should give it a shot. What about the oil filter? Yeah, these things are getting heavier and heavier. Okay, I'll bring this along, and then what else? Uh, again, 
We have plenty of snacks right now. We do also have ammunition. I gotta reload soon, but we do have ammo stored up. So let's get some food. I mean, everything seems all right. I, maybe, maybe the, oh, the fence repair, right, right. Okay, we'll take one fence patch kit. One food, one battery, that's fine. That's fine. We have a fence at 79 over there. I'm not sure when we should start actually trying to fix them though. And we got that bag out there that's been out there forever. So I kind of want to go for it. Unfortunately for me, it's a very long... Oh, it's ammunition, isn't it? Oh, it's ammo and a supply box, I believe. Right? That's yeah, two of them. Pick it up! Not this way. Not this way. Don't die this way. Don't die this way. Quiet night! Oh, thank you. Here, here, here. I know, I know, I know, I know it's looking bad. I know. Let's get a snack momentarily. Then we rest. Actually, use the toilet first, which is faster. Then rest up a little bit. Then we'll have some food. Baby's gonna have to eat pretty soon as well. Don't worry. We we got this. We got this. We got this. Baby, just give me a little while, baby. Mama needs a bat. Mama's had a very stressful day out there. You don't understand. Zombie down there. That's fine. Leave him alone. Another step momentarily. I need to take care of this child before I actually cook a decent meal for myself. I know, zombie. Go ahead and beat it up. It's fine. Somehow, in one single day, I will die of starvation. You explain that to me. I'm not really a resilient human, am I? If I die from starvation in one day. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, shut up, zombies. Let's see about just filling up some snacks here. Where's it coming from? Two from the bottom. One's about to hit that fence pretty soon. Matter of fact, by pretty soon to me now, and they're actually focusing on the ones that have been already weakened as well. Pretty smart zombies, I'll be honest. Thank you for landing those shots. Okay. Now, if I could take care of this and then do... Oh, two more showing up. Go out and do another run. Baby, give me a second, all right? I'll be with you soon. No. a bag out there. Ignore it for later. Uh, let's load up on ammo now if we can. Thank you. Baby, I'm here. I'm here. Don't start crying. Don't start wailing. Mama's here to give you a little bit of comfort. Moving around. How about we just, just take care of the hygiene now? He hasn't actually pooped himself to my knowledge, but um, get rid of that bar now. It's fine. No! Put him back down. Don't mash E because you're stressing out because you're seeing the zombies out here. No reason to freak out. Three incoming next. Great. You want to see? <sighs> How's this truck repair menu? Okay, there's a truck repair menu I can bring up, apparently. Maybe she has to eat so much because she's stressed out, you know? It's like stress eating. Maybe that's the how we should probably view it as. Ooh, I get picked up something that gave me like all of my rest back. Now. That said, starving. And crying baby. Oh, no, 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 no. I need to kill this, this zombie. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, parenting. Hurry, 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 hurry. Have a snack, have a snack. Ah, you're not giving me enough time for anything. Take the soup. Eat the soup. Now I'm apparently getting the runs too because I'm stressing out. There's a toilet. Okay. Nothing but incoming. I just need one quiet night. Uh, good repair skills. This one's gonna hit first, I think. Which fence needs to be fixed, by the way? Uh, 40. Let's take care of it now. I got news for you guys, I'm dipping out right now. I'm seeing a moment. I gotta take this moment. I'm seeing a moment. It could be a bad call on my part, but I saw a moment. We got the athletic shoes, right? Okay. Alternator. Yes. Now, what else? Uh, baby starting to get hungry. Pick up some formula. Snacks have been very useful, let's be honest, but uh, I'll get some food for me. I can get some cooking done and then the rest will be snacks. I think everything else is fine. We need a couple of fence uh, patching kits, though, don't we? 
Oh no, this is the worst time for this because everything is bad. Everything is absolutely terrible right now. In terms of my bars. This is it, child. We're about to perish. At least I'll get you one last meal before that happens, huh? Gun handling? Maybe, I guess. At least it'll be helpful for the future, I suppose. But right now, it is over for us. Look at that fence over there. In the red. It's over. Oh, the zombies are in! Whoa. Oh, lord. We survived 11 days, though. Okay, so now you're seeing the progression that I meant. 51 zombies kills, we gained 8 levels, truck fix 05. I still haven't even get into that freaking truck menu just yet. Uh, but at least we've improved our character a bit. The only downside is that we won't have those uh, those shoes that we got. Uh, I at least want to see what the truck fix menu is like. I think we have to get 5 parts after the toolkit. So let's at least take a little look at that and we'll start probably wrapping up here pretty soon. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Um, all the information for this will be down below. As I mentioned, it's literally $3. So, I mean, for this $3, I think it's definitely worth your buck. Especially if you can get good enough to get on out of here. Curious about that. Um, let's pick up this toolkit. And, I mean, we have a little bit left more, so I guess... Uh, I mean, once since we have the level up in food, I think uh, we could do away with less food. I think snacks would probably be more important just because you could pop them on the fly. As opposed to having to rely on cooking them and waiting and then you know, eat them and all that stuff. Although, when you go and eat at the table, it does also take care of the stress, is it? It gives you a little bit of rest, too. So, let's see, now that I got the toolkit. Oh, we have a quiet night, how cute. I need to replace each part until I fix all the broken ones so we can escape. I hope I can find them all in town. So, timing belt, spark plugs, battery, you need five different parts. Um... Okay, before we actually wrap up, wrap up, let me grab one more part. I want to see how long it takes to actually install it or, you know, quote-unquote, fix it. Assuming I get it before I die of starvation here. Spark plugs and, uh... some snacks. Formula for the future, I suppose. But snacks could be very useful, as we've seen. Maybe some more of those dynamic items would be nice as well. Leveled up, um... Ba -ba -ba -ba. The periscopes, sure. Wanna test these out anyway? Supplies returned. What is this? Cook soup. Eh, it seems we might have enough time to actually we do not. Yes, just barely. Papa squat, Papa squat, Papa squat. Baby, don't cry right now. I just want to go check out this menu really quickly, okay? I owe it to the viewers. There it is. So the spark book is there, I guess. Uh, okay. It doesn't take that that long, but it does still take a while. When obviously the more repair kits, the better it shall be. Mm -hmm. It gives you a nice little experience boost, by the way, to actually do that as well. So if you're looking to level up late game, that could be a bit more useful. Quiet night. Of course, now, now that I'm about to wrap up the video, now it's all the quiet nights in the world. I can actually go out and do some things. Now you could do it before. I'm sorry. Either way, hopefully you guys enjoyed. As I mentioned, all the information down below. Three dollars. It's it's pretty good for three dollars, I would say. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I'll catch you next time.